Welcome to the Bernardo's Golf and Memories. Yeah, first I will show you the lodge, and then later on I will show you something about the beautiful golf course. So stay tuned and enjoy. So this is the Bernardo's Lodge. Going now to the entrance. everything with the code and then the door will open so let's see if the magic will happen right welcome in to my crib beautiful room look at that huh area small safe fridge what's inside uh, look Heineken the typical beer here in the Netherlands everyone is drinking lovely beer so small couch lovely flat screen I love it Close it. Small air conditioner is also inside. Really good. It's not that hot anymore. So look at the view which I have directly to the pool and the tennis court. From the lodge, you have only a five minutes walk to the practice area. So here we are directly at the pitching greens. I think there are five greens. You can play every shot you want, every distance you want. Everything is possible here. Beauty. Beauty. Everything can be played. Also, every lies. Here you can see you can play. Practice nice downhill eyes. So, everything you want to play, you can play here. Here on the left side, you can see already the driving range. Everything is really close by. So, yeah. Driving range. Here on this side, pitching greens. Here you see the beautiful short game area, how big it is, crazy. Here you can see a little flyover over the driving range. The driving range is perfectly built and it's beautiful. You will have free coffee and free water all day and also tightless range balls, how many you want. Here you see the practice facilities with the chipping pitching greens. Also really really nice shaped. And behind you see the three flags. This is the way to the lodge. Look how beautiful the course looks in the morning and the sun is going up. Very nice. 
Hole number one. Let's get ready. Here the fun will start. Bananas, golf and memories. Okay, I'm open behind, you see. This is hole number one. Beautiful. Welcome to the first hole. In total they have six different tee boxes. The tee boxes are named after the length of the course. So if you're playing from the tips, it's called 68. That means the total length is 6800 meters off the course. First hole is a quite easy starting hole, but it's from the tips 418 meters long. Not the shortest, but not that hard. Let's go! Walking down the first hole. Big traps. Next bunker is coming. So looks like you might have a lot of bunker play here. And when you are inside the bunker, it's a steep one. Look at that one to the right. Again, it's hole number one. Very steep. And here's the green. Look like that. Sunset is coming up. Beautiful. Beautiful day today. Lovely. 121 over the bunker. Have you seen that? Was already on top, but coming back. Look at that, it was already up here and rolling back. Close to a perfect shot. Now, bad bunker line. I'm aiming. Let the flag, let it fly. Hole number six is the easiest hole on the course, plus three, 202 meters. Onto the green, lovely. Hole number nine, one sixty nine meters, a little bit downhill. Try to do a small fiber. Oh, beautiful shot. Let's see if it stayed on. It was directly to the tip in. Here you can hopefully hit your approach shot to the green. Then you see a little creek is coming, then the bunker, the nice creek shot. goes on and on and on. 
and then another bunker is also coming. So not easy to play. Okay guys, here's the hole number 12. Par 5, 471 meters. Yeah, that means it is reachable in two, so I want to try and let's go for the second shot and let's see if I can reach it or not. This was my tee shot, so I got 215 left to the green. I had 5 wood, but as you see, it went a little right and into the bushes. Here you can see the way to the green number 12. It is really good defensed by the bunkers, so it's not easy. But as I mentioned, my ball was to the right and not anyway close to the green. So, okay. Hole number 17, a beautiful hole, 149 meters, car 3. Yeah, but as you see, on the left side from the pin, the green is going really, really downhill. And I made a nice shot, but it left like 5 meters left on it. Last green of the the course you see on the, the right hand side, a little bit back side, there's a bunker and also there's a bunker in front of the green. And then next to it there is directly water coming. So not an easy hole to play on the last one, but the last one is always a special one. At the end, a little feedback. In total, it's a beautiful cross. Really, really nice shaped. And they have a special deal. They have like a one day membership. So you are one day member. You can play as many holes as you want. You can play uh, on the range and hit as many balls as you want. It's a really nice course. If you're in that area, maybe as I just drive there and play, it's beautiful. You will never regret it.